Hi Libra, this is your forecast for the month of February 2017. This is a general reading for Libra Sun, Libra Rising, or Libra Moon. If you have a different rising or moon sign, you might find watching those videos helpful or more informative for you. Please remember that these are general readings and so they may not apply to everyone. If you would like a personal reading that is specific to you, please visit my website at thealchemistastrologer.com provided on the link at the upper corner. If you have visited my site before, you'll need to clear your browser's cache for the schedule button to function properly. Now the third week you have the chariot card. This is a major card, so this is an important week for you. Now the cards previously have been very fire oriented. Um, the magician is an air card, but there's a lot of passion behind both of those cards. There's desire. Uh, and the chariot could well indicate you trying to gain mastery over that somehow, whether that is desire, lust, or whether that is anger and temper. And so this could be a week where you're trying to gain some type of control. Now, maybe this is showing up externally. You're having to try to balance and make some progress with some opposition. But you're going to be very determined this week, as you seem to have been all month. Uh, there's initiative, there's drive, there's self-assertion. Again, focusing that willpower towards success and creating some type of triumphant progress for yourself. This is a victory card and there is a single-mindedness to it. Your ambition is important, whatever those ambitions are. And you're putting in that energy to fight for a goal that means a great deal for you because there's a strong sense of purpose. However, there could be a conflict of interest, again, with you or someone else, or perhaps you are struggling with the shadow and light side of yourself. Uh, maybe this is a week where on the mundane level, you're dealing with maybe your vehicle or traveling or some kind of communication. Uh, but you want to stay on top. You, whatever it is, you want to be in control. You want to be in charge. And so you are having to rein in those emotions. You're looking out for your own interests. And so at various points during this week, you may have to try to maintain your composure and hold your anger in. Now, for some of you, that uh, passion has gotten out of control. And so this is a week where you're being reckless. Maybe you feel overwhelmed or you're misdirecting your energy. There's an imbalance of some sort or you lack direction or your plans could actually fall through probably because you were moving at too rapid a pace. You're going too fast. And by the way, be careful of driving this week because this could be a week where you get a ticket for driving recklessly or driving too, too fast. Uh, some of you, because you're so single-minded, the issue is you're being too narrow. You're, 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 t you have tunnel vision and you can't see anything else. You need to expand your focus. Uh, but you could be involved in a struggle this week where you're trying to overcome some obstacles, or maybe you feel restless. Maybe you want to break out and do some traveling. Uh, you could be dealing with a domineering attitude or which the Queen of Wands can be domineering and she can be controlling. So maybe somebody is smothering you or there's uh, some, there could be some difficulties with travel. Maybe a trip was delayed or canceled or again, you had an automobile accident or some car problems. Uh, but this is about focusing your energy in the right direction. So you may be dealing with some desire, whether that is a temptation toward a particular person, a, a particular goal, uh, could be issues of seduction and passion, lust. 
Uh, maybe you're trying to gain control over your mind, what you're thinking, what you're feeling. There's some fantasies playing out for you, or maybe there's some unexpected encounters taking place. For others of you, you're coming up against a wall and your desires have been thwarted. Whatever it is, there are strong emotions running through a situation. Now, for some of you, maybe you're having contact with a cancer person. But your attitudes, your views, your emotions, your outlook, you know, how you are projecting yourself, you are making a very strong impact on others. Uh, now, while you want to achieve something, this, this is going to be a week where sometimes you will step up and take the lead, but sometimes it will serve you to step back and let other people lead. You know, uh, you're coming up with some strategies this week and you may have to make some changes because again, there could be some travel issues, there could be some communication issues that cause you to have to reprioritize either your personal life, your professional life, or perhaps it's going to impact on your finances in some way. Uh, it could be if you take a trip or you're planning to do something, it's going to you know, be more expensive than you thought. Or if you have some car repair, that's going to maybe deplete your savings in some way. Uh, so this is a week to focus on, you know, operating more efficiently by using your leadership skills. Just know that if you do come across some delays or some cancellations or some setbacks, ultimately, in the end, those may bring about more opportunity than they actually cost you. Uh, so this is going to be a very exciting week where, again, if you're traveling, uh, if you're relocating. It's probably because of something romantic attached to it or you're seeking some type of adventure or there's something a little bit different than the norm uh, attached to that. This is going to be a week where you do need to be focused and keep your eye on the target because you're going to have to be uh, patient. It's going to take patience for you to get through things because definitely things are not going to flow the way you had anticipated. For some of you, there again, there are going to be some delays, some kind of miscommunication, uh, some kind of mechanical breakdown. Uh, maybe that's where the magician comes in. Maybe he's got some kind of special skill that can help you overcome some kind of obstacle or challenge. Uh, maybe there's some kind of medical thing that comes up. Now, this is a week for you to be clear, though, on, you know, being self-reliant. If you're looking out there for a person or a situation to lend credence to your life, uh, to make you happy, to make you feel fulfilled, then you are misdirecting your energy. This is misplaced uh, willpower. Uh, this is a time for you to believe in self. Now, some things are going to be beyond your control this week. Uh, and it could happen because of any number of reasons. It could just be an external circumstance, or maybe there was a misjudgment on your part, some kind of miscalculation. Uh, but whatever it is, it's going to create a, a situation where you have to refocus because things are not going to be as smooth as you wanted them to be. So you're looking at your relationships in particular, and those are going to change in some way. They're going to enter a new phase, good or bad, that's going to change your perspective, open you up to some things, uh, give you a greater awareness and understanding.